Dad? Yeah? I need help on my homework. Dolphins aren't hairy, right? I mean, I know they don't have, like, fur, but do they have any hair at all? I think it's time I tell you a little story about a boy named Harry Littleman. This boy was an extremely hairy dolphin. Now, Harry wasn't a regular human from a young age. People around the neighborhood began to notice a few months after the boy's fourth birthday. Hi Charlotte, how's little Harry doing? Oh, he's fine, he's fine, he's really into sea animals. Is your son into marine animals too? Oh no, he's into peewees, playhouse and smurfs, you know, all those little toys. So you say he has an interest in sea animals, what kind? Oh, mostly dolphins. For his birthday, my husband and I, we bought him this dolphin mask. He hasn't taken it off since. His birthday was in October. Oh, well, I've got to get going. See you tomorrow, Sean. His friends were starting to notice Harry's peculiar fascination. Why isn't Harry doing chocolate? I don't know, but this is really funny. What do you do? Well, at dinner, my mom made chicken nuggets, and he insisted he didn't want it. But then later, I caught him scooping tuna out of the can, eating it like raw. Oh, that's so gross. I know, right? It's disturbing and fishy. I see what you did there. Dolphin, fishy. <laughs> Okay, that barely answered my question. I'll just Google it. By the way, that was the weirdest story ever. She'll come back to hear more. They always do. Do dolphins have hair? First one, legend of Harry the Dolphin shocks the tri-state area. Parents of this boy insanely confused. Watch the 1998 interview. Why not? So, tell me about your son. Well, from a young age, he was fascinated with the sea life, mostly dolphins. We thought he was just going through a phase. Uh, our doctor said that it was natural for kids to go through things like this all the time. He said that in time it would pass. But it didn't. As he entered elementary school, his fascination turned into an obsession. You see, other kids used to invite him all the time to the movies. All he ever wanted to do was go to Petco and watch the fish swim. You've uh, taken him to a therapist? Yes, several. They insist it's a phase. What about him growing up? Did any other changes occur? Well, of course. He's 16 now, and uh, he begs us all the time to join the swim team. It's embarrassing. In our swimming pool, he does flips and does this high-pitched screeching noise. I can't stand to watch him humiliate himself in front of the other kids and the coaches. Could you imagine? I see. Well, folks, you heard it here first. Harry, the human dog. Oh my god, Dad was telling the truth. Come back for more? I just saw that interview with the kids' parents. Really? Well, they said this hairy kid is obsessed with the whole dolphin thing. And he made these weird noises in the pool, so the mom and dad wouldn't let him join the swim team. Are you kidding me? My whole high school career wasted because of that. What? You want to hear the rest of the story or what? Anyway, as he was getting older, like his father, he began to grow a mustache. Dad, come in here. What's the matter? Look at this. Oh my word. Charlotte, get over here quick! What's wrong? What's wrong? Is there a fire or something? No, no, no. Our, our boy, he's growing a mustache. Take off the mask. Let me see your face. It's not on his face. It's on his mask. Oh my goodness. All right, I'll have to make you a wax appointment right away. This is crazy. A few years passed and Harry's hairy problem got worse. No amount of hair removal satisfied him. Harry, your hair problem is getting worse. I don't know what to do about it anymore. We've been to every wax specialist in town, and then within a week, it's back again. I don't know what to do anymore. Look, Mom, I'm a dolphin. I can't do anything about this mustache. There must be other options. I mean, I shave twice a day, and it keeps coming back. 
My swimming is being affected and people are making fun of me at school. Harry, I can't help you anymore. You're 17 years old. How can I say this nicely? You're not a dolphin. I thought when you were little, it was just a passing phase, but you know, you're going off to college and you're still pretending you're a fish. A dolphin is not a fish. It's an aquatic mammal. You need to act like a normal person. People aren't making fun of you because you're hairy. They're making fun of you because you're pretending to be a dolphin. Do you know how hard it is for your father and I to raise a dolphin? Where, you know, getting mocked at school functions and, and things around town? We're outcasts. I can see I'm not accepted in this house anymore. I can't wait till I go to college, Mom. Because the minute I do, I'm going to be happy I'm not see embarrassing you or Dad anymore. After that, Harry really came home from college, and it wasn't too long after that that he stopped talking to his parents altogether. What about the whole dolphin thing? Well, uh, Harry had to move on. Um, you know, employers really don't want to hire people who think that they're dolphins, so he put away his mask, and like everybody else, he moved on with his life. That's so sad. Yeah. How do you think he turned out? Well, from what I understand, he was, in a pretty, he was a pretty attractive guy. And more than likely, he got married and had kids and just moved on. Well, uh, did that answer your question about hairy dolphins? Yeah, but I don't think hairy guys in a dolphin costume really count. Well, uh, I suppose you're right. Um, but the bottom line is then, there's no such thing as hairy dolphins. Yeah. <laughs>